Hi, this is Emmanuel. Today we are going to talk about how to run chi square tests of independence in SPSS. Okay, so a chi square test of independence is used when we have two categorical variables. variables. It allows us to test whether the two categorical variables are related to each other. Today, we are going to make use of the data we used in our previous lesson in creating a contingency table. So, the data includes gender of both male and female as, re as, to, as regards their preferred choice of Toyota cars. So quickly, we are going to go straight to analyze descriptive statistics. Under descriptive statistics, we go down to cross tabs. All right, so our agenda is going to go to our role. Our choice of preferred Toyota cars will go to our column. Then we'll go to statistics and check chi-square and click continue. Then we'll go to on the cell. We check our expected count and we click continue and having done this we click OK all right so here is our information here we are having the cross tabulation of the various counts as well as the expected counts okay so the count here is our observe uh, observe counts while the other one is our expected uh, count so what was observed and what is expected okay so now when we go down we'll see our test for uh, tests of uh, our test statistics chi-square chi-square test okay so from our pearson chi-square under the asymptotic significance we would uh, see that this is 0 0.00 which is less than uh 0 0.05 okay so our p-value is less since our p-value is less than 0 0.05 we would um, conclude by saying that there is a significant uh, difference between males and their choice of preferred Toyota cars okay so that is how to run uh, chi-square tests in SPSS thank you very much if you have any question please drop your question in the comment section